My name is Stefan Meyer. I'm from south of Germany. I'm living near the Alps and I worked for five years uh, full time at this project to find everything out. And after I think more than 100 interviews, I finished this work now. The most impressive interview for my person was with Carsten uh, Flierboom from IA Share. It was an unbelievable interview because it helps me uh, to find out the last questions of Caroni and the puzzle fits at the end totally. And I, I like to share this with all Caroni lovers in the world. It was unbelievable. I can't sleep for three, three days, I think so. Here are my top 10 inside questions. Was there a possibility to prevent the closure of Caroni Distillery and which role had Jack Daniels? What happened with all the cask after closure? Do you think they put only Caroni rum in the cask or <laughs> do you have sometimes sherry feelings? Is there still a pot still Caroni rum available to buy? I promise you an unbelievable story. Do you know everything about the column still? Do you think other distilleries use Karani rum for blending? Why were there 3,818 Jamaican rum casks in the warehouse of Karoni? Do you know uh, where the dirty taste flavors from Karoni, where they come from? Do you think all informations on the bottle label are correct? Maybe there are some more bottles or less than on the label. Do you know uh, the Caroni mark LWR and the famous bottling of this mark? All these answers you will find in the book and hundreds more. All the bottlings of Caroni before and after the closure with every fact in high resolution. Taste is something very personal. I found a perfect partner to make the book interactive. On every bottle page you will find a QR code. You can scan it and you come direct in the Ramix app where you find all tasting notes, all the ratings of Caroni of the bottle is shown from the worldwide rum community. The book is uh, multilingual in English, German, French and Italian. Everything in one book. I will promise you that a book will exceed all your expectations.